All right, so for this week, we are going to practice on a comprehension text. As you already know, after discussing the uh, study guide, that we are going to have two parts for the assessment. Part one is going to be comprehension. Part two is going to be the character analysis essay. So we're going to discuss a text and you're going to answer a set of comprehension questions, uh, which are reflective obviously to the comprehension text that we are going to discuss. And if you notice, our next class is going to be a summary. So you're going to be asked to write a, sum a summary. Expect a very simple question in the final, where you may be asked to write a summary of the main idea behind the text, because our entire unit focuses on this and how we can relate to the text. So you might get an opinion question and a summary question, okay? Then we're going just to do a very brief myth. It will not be included in the assessment, but it is part in, uh, of our unit five in the Savas book and perspective. Uh, this myth is about a boy and a father that created uh, wings in order to fly and they defined the rules and the, the laws of the gods. And this was considered problematic. Okay, so we're going to look at the text and we're going to try to look at these words and try to place them in meaningful sentences uh, or find synonyms to them. Um. Also, we're going to have another class. If you notice, I'm focusing on summary a little bit more because I want to make sure that all of you are capable of writing a summary which represents your understanding of a text. So you're going to write a summary based on the plot structure. Uh, how did the myth start? What is the conflict, the rising action, climax, falling action, resolution? A, a little a try to indicate some character traits of the characters, whether they're direct or indirect, and what does this show me? How is it related to the, how is it significant to the, uh, to the myth, and so on. We're going to end this week with a very fun class, okay? So I was waiting for this uh, lesson for a uh, while writing this unit, which is actually creating your own myth. So I know some of you, um, you don't necessarily same, share the same background, and I want you to represent your identity by creating your own myth that reflects your culture. So I want you to conduct a research about your culture before you actually start writing the myth, because we will be present presenting, it, presenting it not next week, the week after, okay? So I hope you enjoyed this unit. We're coming to an end, as you can see, uh, and please dedicate your time with this. This is very engaging, and I can't wait to learn a little bit more about you.